the spa, the girls are taking the easier path to self-care with the classic combo of Prosecco and a hot tub. It's actually a really nice Prosecco. It's really nice. I'm a bottle. <laughs> No. Despite things slowing down across the world, both Sam and Billy have still been busy with their products and fashion shoes, so the chance to unwind today has come at just the right time. When was the last time everyone was in a swimsuit? Mine was the Maldives. Mine was Ibiza when I had my shoe. Yes. You look great in that shoe. Oh, amazing. What I love about like being away with like, that team, everyone is so empowering to one another. I think people might be surprised that I do feel body conscious sometimes. When I was in Ibiza, I just didn't feel 100%, but the other girls in the team, they do make you feel so confident, and that definitely helps. Yeah, you kind of need to hear that when you're shooting as well. Yeah. It just makes you feel better, better. and more confident about yourself. Yeah. I think back when we first started in the industry, it was always only about sexy shoes. And glamour and like... Glam, like bikinis, underwear. And we used to do the glamour stuff. It used to be about what men think. But now I think it's, it's more like, way. as women, and, and me personally, you two probably say, I care about more like what women think of me. I don't care what men think of me. No. That's not because I'm married. It's but just because I'm, I'd rather yeah. make women aspire to be like real and natural and, and like their curve. Back in the day when we did used to do the lads mags and stuff. I can't say I sit here and regret doing that because it was my choice. And I think the way women show their bodies now is different because it is more about empowering women and it's more for us. Whereas back then, I guess it was more for the men. It's taken a whole turn, isn't it? Yeah. There's no lads mags, there's no page free. Yeah. They don't do it anymore. Now, actually, if you're curvy and got a bit of a mum pouch or whatever. People like to people see want that. to see it. Well, because it's real. It's real, yeah. yeah. When I look at the pictures, I'm definitely not ashamed, but I always think back to actually on the day of shooting, girls would have like massive boobs, tiny waists, bigger lips, and it was that feeling of being like, oh, I don't think that I'm good enough. And that's not a nice feeling to have. And I feel like we're in such a good place this day and age with like, women empowering women because obviously I've got a daughter and when she grows up I want her to be comfortable in her own skin. I'm not gonna lie like when I look at some of the magazines my boobs were huge but like, they're a, a fraction of the size now. Mm. I was embarrassed of them because they were abnormally huge for my frame. Yeah. yeah. And then the lads mag set me up. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Here's to us. Yeah. Here's to women. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>